Mesdames et messieurs, bonsoir et bienvenue dans une autre édition WhatsApp Asian. Moi, c'est Cristali Parizo. Je salue tout Haïtien qui suivent nous là dans Zileo, dans Haïti, Sainte Lucie, Martinique, Guadeloupe, Bahamas, Turks and Caicos, avec tout l'autre Zileo tout. Je souhaite nous tous bienvenue. And this evening, we are inviting a guest, a chemist, Maya Hippolyte, and she is joining us today in the show to speak about her product and her company. Thank you for joining me. And thank you for having me. So, first of all, could you please introduce yourself? Tell us how you became a chemist. Well, it was very much by accident, but an accident that I have enjoyed the entire time. I wanted to be a doctor, and then it turns out that I went and got married, and I had to go a different route, so I became a chemist, a cosmetic chemist, to be very specific. What led you to choose that? <laughs> um, like I said, I applied. I started to work for a company where I was a technician at the time. Mm -hmm. And this company was called Carter Wallace at the time. And what they did was everything. If you knew um, arid extra dry deodorant, if you knew Nair depilatory, mm -hmm. that's where I started working in the field of research okay. and development for um, personal care products and then I decided to stay and then I ended up getting my master's degree in cosmetic science. Wonderful. So what does it really mean to be a chemist in cosmetic? Um, this is something where you have a special concentration mm -hmm. in everything that has to do with products, whether it's shampoo, conditioner, uh, skin care, hair care, anything that has to do with deodorants, developing deodorants, antiperspirants, depilatories, anything that has to do with taking care and grooming the body in general, that's what I know how to do. Oh, wonderful. So you actually do the tests, you develop products. You from scratch Everything to from scratch. Yes. Wow. So what experience do you have in this field after you got your master's? What else did you do? Longer than <laughs> I would like to talk about, but experience gives you a lot of knowledge. Um, I've been very fortunate to not only have worked for 10 years in the U.S. in the field of research and development. Mm -hmm. So when you go to your regular, whether you go to Walmart or Target and you see your nair depilatory, the four minutes, yeah. you'll think, you know that this is the chemist who was fortunate to work on that um, specific project. And then I also worked in Europe for a skin, for a company where I was also developing products for five years. And so I got to travel all over Europe and advise and sort of consult and train a lot of people from other companies on how to use our products, especially um, everything that had to do with skincare. Mm -hmm. That's where I developed my skills in skincare. Okay, so you're very passionate about that. Very <laughs> much so. So tell me, you, ha you, you founded a company Eight years ago, Eight I years founded ago. my own company. Morgana's, Morgana's Alchemy. Morgana's Alchemy. Tell me about that. So, How did it start? Um, from the moment that I walked into the, a lab, a lot of people say, okay, they're happy about what they do. Mm -hmm. But I am truly just passionate about research and development. This this is fun chemistry because this is not the boring stuff that you, oh, you know, th yeah. this is much more fun. You get to put things together. You get to be analytical, but at the same time, you're creating something new. And so um, that became very easy for me to do. And I always knew that I wanted to eventually have my own company. Right. And so when the opportunity presented itself eight years ago, I went ahead and I did it. Yeah, that's great. Did you found the company by yourself? Started by myself. By um, started out with three products. Mm -hmm. And now I'm all the way up to 15 different products that wow. I offer. I knew I wanted to very much have a specialty product mm -hmm. in the way that not only it would concentrate on being organic, natural, due to my background being Haitian, you know, we grow up with 
plants and yeah. all kinds of things as our remedies. Um, and I also knew that I had to deliver a product that would give results fairly quickly and for a very large population. That means every skin type. Because oftentimes there are products out there that don't address, for example, us. And mm -hmm. we use anti-aging products just as much as anyone else, but there's mm -hmm. not something specific out there that will help us out. And these one address every skin type. So is it specially for older women or anybody? Um, that would depend on which one. Okay. I actually have a product that's Morgana's Enchantment that can be used by 13 years old when you start to get acne, all the way up to 80, 90 years old. Mm. Wow. Depending. <laughs> so you said, you mentioned that you want to focus on organic. Tell me about what that means, because a lot of people nowadays are claiming organic this, organic that, but what does that really mean? I mean, don't you have to have things that are not very organic to preserve the product? You definitely do, at least in my case, I believe in using at least what um, a preservative, because in any system that you're putting water, mm -hmm. you have to make sure that you have a good preservative so that the product will keep. So when I say organic, as far as the in active ingredients, so the plant extracts, and even some of the oils I use now, I strive to get as much nature, as much of nature as I can into these products. Okay, so you're not, you, you mentioned you're Haitian, but your products aren't just for Haitian people. No. You're, you're no. international. Very much. Yeah, and Very um, much so. where do you sell your products? Where Already you I've been selling, um, the irony of it, I came to the U.S. to start the company, but I ended up started se selling mm -hmm. in Paris. Oh. So I sell the entire line on a French shopping network, okay. and it's called M6 Boutique. Every three months, I get to travel to Paris. It's Wonderful. not a bad job. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I go there, I go on TV, I sell it. Uh, recently, I've been trying to get into the American market as much as possible. Mm -hmm. So I also do a lot of what we call road shows with Sam's Club. So okay. I can go into any Sam's Club within the U.S. They have 650 stores and I can set up a booth for 11 days, 18 days and we get to introduce the entire line. Wonderful. Yeah. Is there any way of uh, finding out when you will be at a It's always Sam's posted Club? on my Facebook page, okay. um, the Morgana's Alchemy Facebook page, and also on the website, we always let our customers know where yeah. we're going to be. That's wonderful. And do you sell products online also? or Online on my website, Morgana's yeah. Alchemy, but also we have, um, very soon, we don't have an air date yet, but very soon to start on the home shopping network, okay. which is HSN. Yeah. They get into over 95 million yeah. homes in the <laughs> US. That's wonderful. So um, two of the products are already on the .com for HSN. So if you want to try out the Instant Lift or the Elixir, mm. you can go to hsn.com and get that. So tell me more about the types of products that you make. You don't make makeup, but you Not do yet. have what, Skin cleansers? Care. I have everything. Toners. I've got a cleanser. Um, the, the brew cleanser is very much a as organic as you're going to get for a cleanser. It's a very mild cleanser. It's mm -hmm. got uh, dandelion, vitamin B, all kinds of good things. So very much for sensitive skin. I have... It, and I say that things are very easy because you cleanse, yeah. you treat the expression lines, and you treat the lines that are called the flaccid lines from the loss of collagen. So what exactly is the flaccid line? So the, <laughs> the flaccid lines are the lines that will start happening when we lose collagen. That's when we see the skin started starting to mm -hmm. sag. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Okay. That would be 
either the Morgana's potion or the Morgana's magic to treat, to, to replace that collagen that we're losing. And then the um, expression lines, mm -hmm. they're the ones that we're constantly doing their repetitive movements. So we have kids, I have three kids. <laughs> Don't do that. That's an expression line right there. Ah. Number 11 that starts to show after a certain age. You can use the Morgana's elixir to make your face look radiant after two or three days. Wow, that's wonderful. Yeah. So tell me about uh, different special products, I mean special ingredients that you use. Special ingredients. Can I get the elixir? Yes, To please, show you? Please okay. Do. So the Morgana's elixir is mm -hmm. one of my first products and it's made with Paracress extract. The Paracress is a little plant that originates from South America, but it's now also available in Africa. Oh. They call it the toothache plant. Okay, <laughs> go, when you chew on this plant, uh -huh. it makes the tongue go numb. You can even remove teeth. Like an anesthetic. Like so. an anesthetic. <laughs> so this, you put the molecules into a cream of this, mm -hmm. and that's what it's going to do, relax your face. Oh. But in a very natural way. You're not going to feel that you're not doing as many movements, but in three days, you're gonna see like, wow, every day you wake up, like you had your eight, 10 hours of beauty sleep. Wow, that's wonderful. Yeah. Any other special plants? So that that's use? that, and uh -huh. I also have, um, I choose my plants from all over. Okay. And so this also has walnut extract. And walnut is an antioxidant. Okay. So yeah. um, antioxidant that's to help protect the skin from any type of environmental damage. Ladies, if you're smoking out there, no, no. But <laughs> if you're using this product, you know that your skin is gonna pr be protected against any type of damage like that. But it, it doesn't protect against UV rays? No, anything no, it's like that. not a UV or no. UVA, UVB. No, it mm -hmm. doesn't have any sunscreen in okay. there, but it will definitely help. This could be your base. And of course, after a certain age, you can use the sunscreen every day, depending on how much, how often we're going into uh, the sun but this would be your basic cream okay. to help with the lines and with the environmental protection. Now, do you also have sunscreens? In no, your line? no, no, I don't have that no. yet. Are you planning on planning having on <laughs> the future? Definitely. Okay, that's wonderful. Definitely. And what about makeup? Are you planning on that? In that will be coming very soon. Yeah. I have to practice. Okay. Because <laughs> I wasn't always a great color chemist. That's a very special uh, field that you need to really be able to put your colors together. And oh, okay. I need that I've done, mm -hmm. but I'll, I'm, go, I'm still practicing, but it'll come. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. So tell me what is the most special thing that distinguishes your line of products from other lines out there? I would say the fact that I put a lot of active ingredients. Active ingredients, tell that me That means that, say for example, if somebody tells you if you're walking and you, you, you're looking down the aisle and you see aloe vera in it, sometimes mm -hmm. they will put it in there just to have the legal claim. Okay doesn't mean that they've put enough for it to actually treat your skin. That's uh -huh. the big difference in the Morgana line. Oftentimes I will not only put um, what's going to help heal and treat, mm -hmm. but I'll put more than what's actually recommended. Right because that's what's going to help you see the results quickly. Tell me, you said you add sometimes a little bit more than the recommended. Right. Is that not possibly harmful? No, no, not if I have everything tested. Okay. So if it's something, because a lot of times it's also price related. 
right. that a company will tell you, okay, especially if you have an ingredient that costs a lot of money because it's organic, it's eco-certified. So very much people are concerned about the bottom line. Mm -hmm. And so uh, if something is really good, then you're not going, and it costs a lot of money, then you're not going to be able to put that much into the formulation. Right. So I look at it closely, and for me, it's about getting the customers the results that they want. So I'll put more if more is needed, but if it's not needed, then I won't do it. So does that mean that your products are very expensive? <laughs> no, not for the quality of the product. They are very much, I would say, an average of 50% less than what a product of this caliber mm -hmm. would cost. Wow. And why, why would you do that? <laughs> I want it to be accessible. Okay. I want it to, for everybody to be able to use these products, like them. And for me, it's not about getting the first sale. It's about having people come back. And I know that when you put it to a, a good price mm -hmm. and that you're selling also a good product, yeah. then you're going to have some loyal customers. And I've got loyal customers. That's, that's great. So just throw a price out there for me. How much would you sell you know, one of these products? Um, the cleanser mm -hmm. is $19. But you see how big it is. Yeah. This is actually got 350 pumps in there. So okay. that means that it'll last a good five months, six months, depending on how often that it's used. If it's used once a day, then it'll be a good six months. Um, if twice a day, then it'll be three months. The oil, for example, the dry oil, mm -hmm. which can be used on the hair, Oh. on the tips of the hair. Mm -hmm. It can be used on your face to moisturize. You can also put it on the entire body as you're coming out of the shower. Mm -hmm. It's gonna keep not only moisturized, but it's gonna make your skin have that special glow. And this one is $39, but it'll last you a good three, four months because not a lot is needed. Okay, so what special ingredient is in that? You like have you can six use on your different hair, types your of oils in there. You okay. know how traditionally they say that um, it's hard to use all of those oils like argan, like cottonseed, like macadamia, and people want to put that, but it feels so greasy. Right. This is a completely different story where I put a another ingredient that sort of modifies uh -huh. the feel of it and you can feel it and you're gonna see how it just feels soft like powder yeah and it's already yeah, there and there's no greasy after feel that's wonderful so you can put it at the ends of the hair to make them shiny you can put it on the face you can put it on at night time uh -huh. mix it in with your regular moisturizer and especially that you can put it on the entire body this is one of those, those products that before you knew it existed, you were okay, but yeah. after you knew it exists, you can't live without it. You can't live without it. <laughs> that exactly must be your best selling. It. I mean, that's very it's much a wonderful concept. quickly becoming my best seller. And I yeah, know it because my teenagers who never <laughs> compliment me, all of a sudden I see <laughs> that the products going out the door being given to their friends yeah. as the gifts. <laughs> Tell me about another one of your products. I mean, the creams and things like that. Well, I don't want to forget men. Okay. And I don't want to men to think that they have been <laughs> forgotten. So I have also a product for men. This one sells ah. particularly well. And I know you men out there, you're always um, trying to do it on the down low. But <laughs> I'll let you know that you are all so welcome to try it. It really helps with the razor bumps. Okay. Um, and anti-aging in general. But this is a really great product and just to show that I haven't forgotten anyone. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and how much is that? This one is that also one. $39, a very good product. It's really, I see that the men are trying to get it off of mm -hmm. Amazon. That's where they go. They <laughs> think that I don't know, but I do know. <laughs> <laughs> 
in the Sam's Club, they come in, you know, can you put it in the bag for me inside? Oh. Yes, okay, it's all right. I would think the women would probably buy it for the men. They also do, the, but yeah. actually the men who come in, they, they try to pretend like they they're not interested, but I know that you are. I won't <laughs> tell who it is. Oh, that's so funny. <laughs> I have to say that I'm very proud myself, being a Haitian, to know that we have a Haitian chemist who does so many great things. But I have to ask you, does the Haitian community support you? Please be honest. Okay, are you sure? Yes, yes, okay, absolutely. Okay. I have to say that the Haitians in Haiti, very much, very much so. They have come to love the product. They recommend it to all of their friends and family. But I must say that it's been a struggle for the Haitian community here in the U.S. Uh, I'm not sure what the issue is um, because I know that I'll hear them over, uh, I'll overhear them speaking saying that they've gone to Macy's to buy this and that and the other product but yet they're not supporting Morganas and I'm wondering why because the product is just as good if not any better than any other product that's out there. Do you think that's maybe because they don't really know you over here? I mean, do you do any marketing whatsoever? Um, I wouldn't say that because I meet them face to face inside of Sam's Club, for example. Okay. And so every other, I would say, whether it be Caribbean, whether it be from South America, Americans, mm -hmm. they're always purchasing from me. And the Haitians are always the ones who are running away. So, you know, it's not that. Why is that? I, I have no idea. <laughs> and I'm wondering. Huh. Because we should really always support each other. Well, ho yeah, absolutely. Oh, hopefully after they see this interview, they, they wake up. <laughs> yes, and smell the coffee. Yes. Because <laughs> <laughs> we're doing good things too. Yeah, every, every Haitian, I always say that, every Haitian who does something positive and good, we should always be supporting each other. You know, it's... Be behind, I have each other's backs. That. Yeah. Let's talk about your testing. You, where do you test the things? I mean, do you have a base somewhere uh, for your products where you test everything? Every single product that I develop, once I get the right formulation, mm -hmm. I have independent testing, independent clinical okay. testing. So I will send it out to a lab and that costs a lot of money, but it's very well worth it yeah. because it's not just taking my word for it, it will be someone else, someone else yeah. validating what I'm saying. So um, anything, if I say I have tested the Morgana, the spot remover for the for spots, mm -hmm. I will have it's been independently clinically tested to show that okay, in, indeed this product starts to work at 10 days, like I tell people. Wonderful. So um, how do they test it? Do they test it on? Animals no or testing on animals. Okay, it's voluntary. <laughs> um, it's very voluntary. People are, are paid to mm -hmm. come in and to test the products, mainly women. Okay, and how do you yourself develop the products? Do you just do it at home, or <laughs> do well, you have I've a? Actually, I started out in my kitchen. Oh, okay, and now I've actually built my own lab. I have an entire lab. Um, test, go, I travel a lot to go find different ingredients, different plants, yeah. and I come back and I test them. And where, where is your lab? Is um, it it's here? in Newport Ritchie, Florida. Oh. Okay, oh. Right. Okay. <laughs> For now, that's where I am. Wonderful. So, um, unfortunately, we have reached the end of our show. So I want to thank you for joining me once thank again. Thank you for having me. And I learned a lot of interesting things. And I will be supporting you. <laughs> and I <laughs> hope my fellow it. Haitians will too. Tout aïsien qui a regardé là, pas fait tant que l'effet dit là, à le supporter l'autre aïsien. Dégagez nous. Is there anything else you would like to say before? Well, I'm hoping that um, everyone, and again, this is not just for Haitians, but I'm hoping that the Haitians will also join the whole Morgana's alchemy wagon. Thank you so much. Okay, It's thanks. been a pleasure. Malheureusement, nous vivons en fin émission aujourd'hui. I would like to once again thank Maya Hippolyte for joining us today and speaking about her products. I will see you all next week, same time.